If curiosity turns up any evidence that life once existed on Mars, it will have enormous implications. If right here in our own little solar system, life started twice, then it would say that life is just everywhere. Curiosity and other missions may one day reveal if life once existed on places like Mars, and if it still exists today. But even if scientists ultimately conclude that there is no life on the planets closest to Earth, it doesn't mean it's not out there. Beyond Mars are other worlds waiting to be explored. The distant moons that orbit the giant planets Jupiter and Saturn Moons just as strange as the orange-shrouded Titan. One pockmarked with hundreds of volcanoes. Others glistening with ice and covered in mysterious lines. And one tiny moon etched with deep fissures. We're now finding, when we look at these giant planets and their moons, that they are almost like mini solar systems in themselves. Probes are making discoveries on these moons that are changing our understanding of where life can exist. They're finding evidence of new sources of energy. Hidden oceans of liquid water and organic molecules blasting into space. And far beyond these worlds, scientists are exploring entire new solar systems around other stars. Surely billions, hundreds of billions, of the Earth-like planets out there uh, have the conditions suitable for life. As scientists race to explore these distant places with more and more advanced technologies, they're finding that the conditions for life are not exclusive to Earth, and that the natural forces set in motion here might be active elsewhere, in our galaxy and beyond.